Hi everyone, it's me, Layla. I'm here with a card share. Uh, they're custom orders for birthday cards, um, and they're very, they're kind of theme specific. The the girl that I'm making them for like is kind of girly. She likes Hello Kitty. Uh, she likes to travel. So I went ahead and created two different cards. One that's kind of um, travel related and one that's girly. So I'm going to go ahead and move my sign out of the way and I will jump right into the, the card chair. This is the first one I created and I really, really like it. It turned out really pretty. Um, it's the, the, This is a 6x6 six six card. Uh, the card base is kind of a khaki color uh, card base. Uh, it's They're 12 by 12 and I just cut them down the size. Um, they, it's layered with corrugated, um, uh, craft and blue paper. Uh, it's this one right here from, um, DCWV, and I got it from Joanne on Clarence for a couple bucks, which is a really good deal. And this is the color that I used. And, um, the, this part right here is layered with white cardstock. And then it, this one is the new paper pad that I bought. It has a map. If you can see, I'm trying to go closer without fading. It has a map, uh, so that's a travel theme. The clouds are made basically. I cut a stencil this length, um, and I just went over with eyeshadow. And it added just a tad bit of shimmer, not too much, just the right amount basically. And I randomly placed it so the clouds are not going all in one direction. Because then that will look pretty fake. Because clouds don't go that way. Anyways, and then I tried using some sequins. And I thought it really turned out pretty. Um, silver sequins for stars. And they're all over the top. This butterfly is by Recollections. And it's in their wedding sticker section. And it's this pack right here. You get the flowers and the butterflies. There are a lot. And I think I'm going to go back and grab a couple more because they're in white and you can always um, uh, dye them. Color them, in other words, is what I meant. Uh, this trim right here is from the dollar, $2 bin at Michael's Mesh Bling. Same here. It's the, um, the pom-pom trim. This little die cut right here is brand new to me. Um, I just got it from Amazon a couple of days ago. And it's this right here. It's by Kane Company. Um... In very pretty colors, very summer colors, yet they have earth tone colors to it. Um, and this piece right here is a wood, wood veneer um, that I got from Walmart a while back. For hearts, butterflies, flowers, and I think stars. And they're different shapes. So I just colored each with um, eyeshadow. And then the top one, I added a little bit of glossy accent just to shine it up a little bit. And then half the flower and this gem that I got from Hobby Lobby. I added some mesh bling. This is colored um, with Prismacolor pencils. And it's a stamp right here. I don't know why I said stamp. Huh? But it's a stamp that I got from AC Moore's. And it's uh, called, sorry, there you go. It's Hot Air Balloon. It's by TPC Studio. Uh, this this image. And I just fussy cut the hot air balloon with the cloud and the banner. Um, this part right here where it has the little twirly thing. I did not. I cut. These two are separate pieces. And I'll show you what I did to kind of hang them together. And I did not do the starburst in the back. I just did not care for it that much with this card. Right here. Let me pick up the card. If you see. I have Twine. Come on. I know you can do it. Okay, well, I have twine that's holding the hot air balloon basket and the balloon itself. And I thought it was, there you go. And I thought it was really pretty and different. I uh, added these flowers that are from uh, Michael's uh, $2 bin. These I colored uh, with um, acrylic paint to match this cloud kind of. So that's basically the outside of the card. Fairly simple yet very pretty and elegant. And then the inside is very world theme. I cut these banners out from the paper piece. Um, this is a stamp that I have right here. And this is also fussy cut from the same paper line as that. Uh, and you can write your message right here. So that's card number one. And now I'll do card number two. 
Um, sorry, I did not take it out of its envelope. This is card number two. I thought this was very pretty also. Uh, I did basically like a darker blue, or not a darker blue, I'm sorry, a turquoise blue, because uh, I thought it would look pretty. And I'll start with the card base. It's kind of a blue um, card base, and it's an easel card. Uh, I, I don't remember this paper, and I paper line, but the whole back is... Um, brown with yellow flowers and I distress the edges with blue ink. This is